Well, it's the first week in June, and Dan and I are at the sixth, it's called the sixth water fork of the Diamond Fork River in central Utah. This is a small stream, but it's public water. This, this segment I'm showing here is a real time. In other words, I haven't edited it to, to be shorter and more exciting. So from the point where he comes down the hill uh, to the end of this clip is real time. I don't know, he's behind the tree there and stuff like that. But I wanted to show you that you can climb down, <laughs> climb down a hill into a place and get one on the first cast, on the, of the first cast and the whole, the fracture of the first cast of the day. So, but you need to pick your spot. This is not an easy place to do a video. The, uh, the Diamond Fork, where, where the, uh, we have these giant stoneflies, is, is uh, uh, usually rough. You know, they like big rocks and so they live around big rocks and things and, and so forth. So we got in this part of the, of the six water where there's a trail so that you can see what we're doing. <laughs> the other places, uh, almost impossible. It's a brushy place. This is not a place that's easy to fish, but it's a challenge. And it's a place where you can go where one of the few places around nearby anyway that you can uh, fish with the, when these big stoneflies are hatching. Used to be in the Pro Bowl, but that's changed now because of, I think, uh, differences in water quality. It's a sad thing that they're gone from there. Hopefully someday they'll come back or get reintroduced. Anyway, tough to land a fish in this kind of water, but Dan can do it. Fish went downstream and uh, have to be patient. Yep, there he is. That's the spot that we, that uh, he actually fished uh, into. That's where the fish was, just in front of that rock. Of course, he's, he's moved in on the hole now. That's funny, because he was right in the exact spot in that hole where we said he would be. And I don't know if there are any more or not in there because he probably stirred the hole up a little bit. I didn't see, I didn't get any more hits, but then again, I didn't really cast in there that many more times before I got hung up. So. Now this is further upstream. The big log across there and and uh, <laughs> I'm, a, I'm on the right behind the tree. You can't see me because I'm off the screen, but I've approached this. This is a great spot. It's deep. You know, there's got to be a trout there. Some problems with it, though. What do you suppose? Yeah, I got him. I had him on. I got him on. You can't see where our cats, but I had him on. Played him hard, but what happened? Do you suppose? He ran under the log. Okay. And uh, I tried and tried to get him out, and I couldn't get him out. It's my fault. It's anger error. You know, maybe I'm getting old. Should have should have played him a lot harder, and I didn't. That's the mistake. So had to break him off. You're going to break him off. Point the rod straight at the straight at the snag and pull back. Don't do, don't bend the rod to break it. Break your rod, maybe. So I'll try again. This is fast water and, and the sun was at our advantage and so I put a dry fly on and bang, I caught one right away. This one, I didn't mess with. I got, I got him in. Yeah, play him in the air. Well, we've come back to Diamond Fork to uh, check on the stonefly hatch. Last week we didn't get any, and this I've already lost a couple. This is just by sampling just like one square meter area. And uh, none of these are the really big ones, but this looks like this is three different age classes right here. And they, they have like a... Small like guy, a, the, medi the medium guy, and the two large, like but there's a, like a... Like a three, like a three-year cycle. They can actually get large. Well, I, uh, I looked it up, and they said they can have a three- or four-year cycle, depending on where you are. Here's the stonefly on the, on the grass there, by the side of the stream. They're good-sized insects. I'm going to try to catch one. They won't hurt you. Looks creepy, but they won't hurt you. 
And that that thing on the screen there is a caddis, a caddis fly. And all those little things flying around, those are caddis flies. Trout love those, but but today they wanted the stone flies. There's a snake. He's waiting for a stone fly. I'm gonna get him. Nope. <laughs> I think I couldn't get him. <laughs> 